What's the main difference between the old Subin Tian and the new Subin Tian? The biggest thing is we've changed the start. So his acceleration is even better than it was before. He, now in this race, the 983, he's had the, the best acceleration in history. That was the fastest 30 meters ever recorded. He's still a little stuck in stride frequency, which is why you saw people catch up to him at the end of the race when he ran the 983. I think if he'd hit that uh, stride length properly, he would have run 979, 978, which he's capable of. The next question is, do you think 983 is a limit? And I think you have already assumed yeah, that. No, no, it's not the limit for sure. A, a, a years ago, three years ago, I should say, um, I was in a meeting with everybody and I said, they asked me how fast can you run? And I told them, theoretically about 978 is about what I can see as his limit. And he came pretty close to that in this race. You know? So we're getting closer, closer, closer to perfection. Will guys work together to prepare for the Paris Olympics in three years? Don't know yet. Um, I know he, I know he wants to go one more year. I think I'm not going to speak for him. I think that'll be his decision. Hmm. I know I'm going to go home for a while and make a decision about whether I'm going to come back. I haven't been home for several years and I've been gone for eight years. Um, and I think, you know, I have some, I have some decisions to make about what my life is going to be in the future. Well, one of your interview after men's 100 meters final goes popular online and the Chinese netizens say they want to thank you for your contribution and they realize the efforts you have made over the years. Anything you want to say to Chinese netizens? Oh, well, well thank you for the, the, the thank yous. Um, you don't get, you, as a coach, you don't get many of those. So it's nice to see that people appreciate. For us, it's not about the money. I mean, we, you know, compared to soccer coaches and other basketball, we don't get paid that much. Um, but it's really about being appreciated. To be appreciated for what you're doing is, 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 is really a big part of why we do this. I mean, to see Gong win that shot put, you know, and, and, and then to see the silver medals and see Zhu come out in the triple jump and do what he did. I mean, these are all things that uh, are, are just great to watch as a, fan of the sport we always call ourselves dream weavers you know our goal as coaches is to weave the dreams you know weave the fabric of their dreams so they can they can achieve that dream and uh we just try to do the best we can